Good day folks, this is Greg Judy at Green Pastures Farm here in the middle of March and I want to talk a little bit about soil compaction layers on our farms and some of the tools that we use to evaluate that and you know this farm that we're standing on today it is a clay base um, we had one to two inches of topsoil on here way 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 back I don't know 2006 and we started with our uh, ultra high density you might say mob grazing, plan grazing, adaptive grazing, whatever you want to call it. Basically focusing on trampling litter on the ground, feeding the soil microbes, getting more earthworms out here. And so we went from one to two inches of topsoil. We had, uh, this is the soil penetrometer behind me, um, and it measures the inch pounds that it takes to bury this probe. And we're going to go over that a little bit. It goes to 300 inch pounds. And uh, it's got a it's got a uh, a deal on the end there. It's like a, a spinning top. It's a, a round sphere. And as you stick this in, as you can see on the end, it's got a meter on it that actually measures how much inch pounds it takes to push this down. Uh, we started out with 300 inch pounds at about eight inches. I want to show you something. Watch this pro. I took it clear to the clear to the handles, three feet, okay, and it never went over 90 inch pounds all the way down. Folks, this is yellow clay, red clay under here. Look at the color of that dirt now. It's black, it's brownish black. Um, we can go up here. It's just okay. Just that one went about 110 inch pounds. How, we, how did we do that? We did it with animals and grazing and trampling and feeding the soil. We're not grass farmers, folks. We're microbe farmers. Remember that. If you want to make a good living out here on the land, you've got to do more than feed the soil. And the animals, you got to feed yourself. And the only way to feed yourself is to stay on the land. If you're not making a profit, you're not going to stay on the land. you got to take care of it. Soil is number one. Feed it. Feed the soil. There's more soil life on an acre, per acre in weight, than there is above the ground in soil in, in life. There's more soil life below the ground. But you gotta feed it. I mean, look at this. <laughs> There's no inputs. It's animals, it's life, it's fence, and it's water. And you know, this is the tool that we use. This one's called the Dickie John. It's about 120 bucks. You can go around your farm, you can find your hard pan with this dude. You can see how far and how much topsoil you got in. And go around your farm and lay this out. That's what we did. And we can go back and check and uh, see, you know, what the, how far we can take this thing down. Um, what's really neat is to go through the middle of a manure pat. When the cows get over, I may make a video of that later in the summer, but you can push this thing in the ground and go right over, and it, let's say it goes to 120 inch pounds, you can go into a manure pile and it'll bury it to here. Why? And it doesn't even reach an 80 to 90 inch pound. It's because of all the earthworm castings and all the holes underneath that manure pile. Folks, we need more worms and you gotta feed them this. This is Greg Judy signing off. Everyone have a great day.